Hey, it's cool you if you don't know, and uh, doing something a little different, but not all that different. Uh, a special long run crosscode stream. Um, and this one is going to be pretty much all cleanup, uh, no actual uh, story content or progression. Um, we're going to avoid leveling up if possible. So if you want to skip this one, it's perfectly fine. Um, also, I will also do this so I can better see the chat. But it's good to be able to see your chat when you're when you're doing a stream. That's a good idea, and I usually set this up before the stream. But uh, I'm a doofus. Who would have thought? I am a doofus. You know what? I'm not going to bother cutting this. I'm just going to leave it in, because this is not an official stream, so I'm not going to worry about it. Uh, so first thing that we're going to do is replace the Sonic Spike with the... Uh, which one is it? Not for sure. Burglar's Rope. There we go. Burglar's Rope is a zero XP uh, piece of equipment, which of course means disables XP from defeating enemies. We are also going to be completing some old quests, and when I say old quests, I mean anything from Gaia's Garden and previous. Um, so we probably are going to level up a couple of times. But uh, for the most part, we're going to be mitigating that as much as possible by wearing zero XP here. Okay, let's see. So first of all... All of these quests are our goal today. Oops. Interesting. Um, and we're going to start by going to see uh, Tall Tulips. Oh, that's okay, Jewel. I, I appreciate you dropping by, and uh, for for as long as uh, as you are able to uh, to do so, I'm not really super worried about uh, viewer numbers until I actually hit the uh, the 50 follow threshold. Oh, was she at the was she at the quest hub? Yeah, she is. She's in the Baki Kum quest hub. Okay. Yeah, I mean, that's fair. Like, I, I did say that I was planning on doing this, but I didn't say when. So, if you can't stick around for too long, that's, that's perfectly fine. Howdy, girl! Hi! I found a way to spice up the... Spice up that hat of, yeah, oh, I gave y'all. Y'all ready for an upgrade? Here y'all go! Dried grass hat. Bigger and better, just like that. I'll see y'all in the fields. Till next time. Bye! It would have been funny if I had immediately gotten a dealing saying like I got 75% of flowers. Okay, so now we're going to go back to Rookie Harbor. And we're gonna go look for that uh, thief.
Hey, you, have you seen a thief? No? Oh yeah, I think there's a... yeah, there's a gold chest here. With a hungry sim. It also helps that I have the chest detector now, so... I'm gonna actually, um... more effectively look for treasure. Which one of you is a thief? If you're a thief, please raise your hand. Find the thief near the park in Central Rookie Harbor. Yeah? Did you come by to check how business is going? Oh, how nice of you. It's going great. Those steaks really hit the bullseye with people, people's taste buds here. I talked to our Valley customers and got some more ideas to improve up my precious meat even more. How about it, gal? You feeling in, are you feeling it in you to help me out again? Uh, looks like we can help you immediately. Yeehaw! I knew I could count on you, my dear. Just like last time, it's all about the ingredients. I've done some pre some research on the precious plants of the East. Once again, I'd like to try some new wood combination with what, with what we already got. So please bring me some old wood from the from the jungle in the Northeast. I also want to experiment a bit with marinating the meat before grilling. For that, I would love to get my hands on some honey and a bunch of sweet apples. You should find all that Nam's Fall in the east, of, or that jungle I mentioned. As for the meat, I still got a lot of, of that here to experiment. Is, there, is everything else clear? Alright, give you give it your all. Bye! Hi! Gal, yeah, you're back! And what is that? Do, you, do I see some of the most perfect ingredients that have ever been found? Yes, yes, exactly what I wanted! Perfect! Just you wait. I'll put the I'll put it to good use immediately. Mm -hmm. I... Oh my! By the ancients, this this might be the best piece of meat that ev that has ever grazed this planet. Truly, yeah, I'm I'm serious. You gotta taste some of this. This is perfect. Here, take a few to enjoy, but make sure to brace yourself when eating. I'll make sure to stock up on booth right now. There'll be as many as you can eat. Thank you all again for your hard work. I hope to meet you again many times in the future. Oh baby, um... Bye! Alright, so now we can buy this gourmet steak, which gives us a bunch of buffs for 90 seconds. It's not bad. Okay. Now if I if only I knew which thief like which central park you're talking about. Park in the southeast. Are you a thief? No, you're just like staring at trees. Fine. You. Hi. Ah, what what do you want from me? Hi, Leah, hi. I I see. So you want to you want to arrest me for my crimes. Alright, it was only a matter of time, but I just had to earn money somehow for for 
Here, let me show you. My speedy escape! Bye! Actually, let me just do something real quick here. I am also in the um, the Wapa voice chat, so in case anyone decides to drop by there. Okay, so now I go talk to you. Um, wait, how do I get there? <laughs> Up here. Damn, I saw that you got away from me. What the, what the hell happened there? Well, it's done, it's done. I saw him running southwest to a dead end alley by the sea. Made sure to catch him this time. So, what's your deal? Hey, blue haired girl! Hey. Crossworlds is full of bizarre and cool things! I hope you enjoy your stay and never give up! Oh, okay. Sure. You scared me. Uh. Ah. That's where that chest is. Let's grab that and get some fruit drink. And is that all of the chests in Rookie Harbor? No, there's still one left. Oh, um, I got that one. Also thinking maybe you mean over there. Ah, there we go. Oh, it's a YouTube guy. I had no idea, so. I probably have uh, completely not matched their voice. Hi. Ah! You again? Okay, I guess that's the end of the line then. It's really a shame. That you're so slow, bye! You're too slow! Scoundrel ran past here. You must have given him a solid spanking. Good job. Still not satisfied? Well, he ran toward Autumn's Rise if you want to whip him some more. Oh, that, that narrows it down. Well, let's go to Autumn's Rise. Sir, did you see a thief run by here? No, okay. You're not paying attention. Laser bridge. Aha! Hi! Ah, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, help me! Also, those were obviously not boosted. Hi! I, I am so sorry, for real this time. I'm serious, I'm out of smoke bombs anyway, otherwise those damn hedgehogs would never have gotten me. 
Now maybe they've been sent by the tribe to show me the error of my ways. This time I'll turn myself in and atone for my crimes, truly. So, if you'll excuse me. You're coming with me. But I was gonna come to you anyway, don't you trust me? Sorry pal, trust is nice and all, but I won't take any more risks with you. Alright, alright, jeez. In any case, thanks girl. You did great work here. Report back to the chief to get your award. Alright, off we go. <laughs> Someone's gonna rise for sure. Oh, Jewel, you certainly, you certainly are. <laughs> I already got the report. You did a fine job out there for a rookie. Well, heck you do, bud. In any case, you're welcome to help us out again in the future. The rookie harbor guard is always busy. The paltry 15 experience for doing this at level 53. Nice to see you around, rookie. We have need of your assistance again. And as if the usual struggle with the track isn't enough, we have violent threats growing, it, growing from within our own settlements. And it seems like some of the people are smuggling dangerous weapon systems onto the continent through our, uh, through our harbor. Needless to say, this is a danger for every law-abiding citizen on the planet. So can I, can I count on your help again? Sure. Excellent. We already got Officer Cedric inv investigating the case right, right on location. Meet up with him at the harbor at Beginner's Arc and he'll, br give, he'll brief you on the details. I am not the best at cold reading, but I do the best that I can. supposed to meet here? I'm not seeing anyone with a with an exclamation mark on top of their head. Uh, let's go ahead and add that. Right after Cedric at the beginner's arc. there. Well, Seeker, I assume they, they sent you to help me investigate this smuggling case. Excellent. I want you to examine the crates on the eastern part of the harbor. The data signature of the suspicious goods has already been sent to you, so you should be able to sense it. Hi! I'll be, I'll be here investigating our leads, potential culprits. Come back when you find something. Unfortunately, I completely overpower this guy, and even with it, even with its shield on, uh, kind of no match for us. I see you found something here. What was up with that noise? I what? There was an automated turret in the crate, and it just attacked you on its own. It's worse than we thought. And there might even there might be even more of those around here. 
But at least we have a suspect who is involved in this crime and should still be near. Keep an eye out for a shady, uh, shady looking dog while we're checking out crates. We might be able to properly solve this mess once we get them. Shady dock holder. Well, this guy wasn't here before. Hi. Huh? What? Can't you tell I'm working? Leah. You want to know what I'm doing? Keeping this harbor running without proper payment, as usual. But hey, if, this, if the high mighty seeker wants to inspect our shipments that badly, just give me a second. Any second now. Here, eh? Or not. Hi! Can't let a humble worker earn his cash in peace, huh? Uh, but trying to know me on my home turf was a bad move, lady. Now stay here and stop bothering me, will you? I'll even leave you some company. <laughs> Yeah, I'll get some small amounts of money, and like not a whole lot. And something, I guess. Hi. Damn it, you again? Still not satisfied after all those shipment inspections? <laughs> you sure are persistent. Well, I guess it is time to bury the hatchet and get one of those lawyers, eh? Nah, of course not. Or maybe I'll just get rid of you and walk away. How's that sound? Yeah. Say all you want, there's no turning back now. Don't think that's all I got. trouble those buckets of junk can't even get rid of some seekers. It makes you question the point of it all. Hey, I'll be nice. No need to get violent with me. Well, I guess I do have to face my problems the responsible way now. Why does everybody have smoke bombs? Ouch. Don't move muscle. I've had just about enough of illegal turrets and smoke bombs being thrown around here. Don't let, don't let falling for his little trick bother you, Seeker. It seems to happen all the time lately. He did good work flushing him out and disposing of those toys of his. You sure do. You sure like to get rough as long as it's. You sure like to get rough as long as it's just us lowly workers, don't you? Keep your mouth shut. We can have a nice long talk back at the station. You better go there too and report to Sergeant Brassler. He'll be he'll be pleased with what you've done here, even if he doesn't show it. Alright, off you go. Don't make me tie you up and carry you all the way. Okay, okay. At least uh, leave a hard-working citizen some dignity. Alright, back to Sergeant Brass Tax. Hopefully not, uh... Spending too much time running into walls it doesn't tend to be a very productive uh, thing to do. How many monies do I have? 121,000. Cedric already made a, made a report and brought the criminal in. For such an impressive guy, he sure caused a lot of- uh, For such an unimpressive guy, he sure has caused a lot of trouble. Yeah, it's unlikely that he acted alone. For starters, those shipments must have been sent by someone else. 
We'll put him through some sharp interrogation until he spills beans about his, his accomplices. Alright, that's on us now. Cedric told me that you did well in handling this, so enjoy your reward. 800 bucks and a battered fist. Some sweet berry tea. Hi! Well, Seeker, found your way back to Humboldt Rookie Harbor, eh? About time, frankly. This whole weapon smuggling business didn't do us the courtesy of just stopping. In fact, it's only gotten worse. You got some free time again to make a contribution to a peaceful society? Level 36, so this one comes a little bit later on, but uh, we're still over level for this. Good to see you didn't forget your roots. Stopping criminals like the old days. Problem is, they're not delivering their shipments to our harbor the usual way. It's where we can find and catch them. Instead, the weapons are sent over the ocean on, on their own to who knows what secret transfer point. Basically, we have to catch and destroy them midway on their route from around the square. We got something prepared. Go to Beginner's Ark, talk to Captain Turbine south of the, tel uh, south of the teleporter. He'll give you a more detailed briefing and send you in the right direction. Now get going, Seeker. Bye! probably about the time that we would be heading into Autumn's Fall. Our Seeker, you the one they sent to, to board our proud battleship here? Hope a land lover like you can hold your own without steady land under your feet. The sea's a fickle lady, I tell you. Alright, alright, just want to get you in the mood. Think like a smog road to catch one, eh? Not a lot of criminals these days, sending weapons directly over the sea. Only way to catch them is by intercepting them directly on the sea. This is where you come in, Seeker. You'll, pat you'll patrol the suspected smuggling routes with our state-of-the-art combat platform here. It's equipped with a naval protection cannon, or NPC for short. <laughs> oh, I see what you did there! Uh, that's linked with uh, your fancy track walker systems. So you'll be able to easily mark targets with your charged projectiles, and the cannon will do the rest. Once more, your fancy heat and cold elements will give our cannon special properties. Everything's been set up already, so just talk to me again if you want to start your patrol. Ready to go? Let's do it. Good. That's all you program programmed into the ship. Just get aboard. Make sure to destroy as many weapons as you can. If too many get through, this operation will be considered failed. Well, I'm sure you could have guessed that already. And off you go. Good hunting. Bye. Cool. be just slightly overloaded for this. Why did the, why did you dash like that? So the ship HP is like super low. 
so I might not want to slack so much. The idea here is to basically uh, protect the ship by blocking shots. Preferably not blocking shots with my face. There we go. Welcome back, Seeker. It seems like you wrecked that shipment nicely. Well, also a good test run for our NPC here, and I think it'll be very useful defending against future attacks. In any case, he did well, but I'm sure you want to be back on land again. Report back to Sergeant Brasser now to get your due reward. I'll send those impressive combat logs immediately. Bye! Smuglia is the biggest mood. Seeker, now we received the combat report. Splendid work. Mm -hmm. But you sunk must have been an entire month's worth, worth of work. That should set them back a lot and give, give us some room to breathe and work on long term solutions. Oh, I'm sure it'll be around. Uh, I'm sure we'll see you around again if the time comes. Until then, good fortune on your adventure, Seeker. Bye! Alright, so that's all from this guy. I'm gonna go to the quest hub and see if there's anything else. That's not the quest hub. So there is one quest here that is um, actually current? Oh, you know what this is? Um, with the last uh, update for CrossCode, they put out the console-specific quests. So a Switch in Altitude is not a Chapter 9 quest so much as it is, as it is the the quest specific to the switch. Uh, so rookie harbor, fall divers, and the end. I'll probably keep the uh, switch specific quest for like actual stream time rather than extra stream time. Fall divers, fall divers are over here. Welcome, Seeker. It's been a while. Seems like you've really been around by now, eh? Yep. Your experience will come in handy. We made progress with that device you found back then. Yep, it was a bit of busy work, but it gave us some leads for future expeditions. How about it? We could really use the help of a Seeker who knows their stuff. 
Sure, why not? Great! Now I can finally use our new toys with you on board. Can't tell you much about it myself, but we got one of our tech specialists, Degert, waiting for you. Meet him at the village remains in Autumn's Fall and he'll explain everything. And it's right at the border of Autumn's Rides, in case you forgot. Alright, then go. good luck with that and give, De uh, give Degert my regards. Bye! So we'll go there in a second. But first, um, we have that training thing in the info center. Uh, this is not the end, is it? No, this is the info hub. It's the combat practice turn. Okay, so I could have used circuit resets this entire time. Power within you, I sense. Ready to explore the depths of your abilities, you are? Sure, why not? To experience. Precious. Good, yes, yes. Speak to me to begin next. Already expecting you, I am. Ready to train, are you? Yes. Once begun, endure until the cause is finished, you must. Wisely you made your decision must be, yes. A good choice to the art of balls, open your mind it must be. Tested in uh, tested in this training, your precision and perception will be. Hmm. Floating you must be for this, yes? Worry not, trust in your sense and you must. Now begun the training has. First you must un yes, first your basic understanding we will test, yes. Hit all the targets you must. That you can do, can you not? Oh I mean, pretty sure. Now again, but quickly. Hit all te hit all targets in ten seconds. You must. Good, yes. Now your understanding of ricochet is sure to me. Hit all targets using ricochets, you must. Okay. Alright. Oh, I did hit that one. Okay. Targets using ricochet you must. Or again you must. Alright. Um. Ah, interesting. So those walls, the kind of pinkish ones there, absorb the RPs. I don't think I can make that shot. Wait, how do I get that? I'm glad I'm not timed. Huh. Okay, well that works. 
That also works. That works. In you, perhaps a true seeker sleeps. Your aim next, we must test. Hit the target ten times without missing or throwing too much, you must. Constant, a seeker's aim must be even when moving the enemies. Hit the target ten times without missing again, you must. That was totally on purpose, by the way. One you missed. Become better, you must. Ah. God dang it. Yeah, I missed the first shot, so I didn't really care about any of the other ones. A fine student you are, yes. <clears throat> Your final test now comes. Hit all targets without missing within 10 seconds, you must. We already did this! the calls you have. But far from over your training is. For now, rest. When ready for your next lesson, speak to me, you will. Okay, well, let's do it. No, it's not what I wanted to do. Cancel training. Good choice. To the art of the blade, open your mind must be. Tested in this training, your strength will be, yes. Throw you cannot, guarding also disabled will be. Now begin your training as. First, basic understanding we must test, yes. Hit all targets you must. Simple it is, yes? All targets in 10 seconds, you must. A fine display. Now, multiple enemies at once, you must hit. Hit all targets in 10 seconds, you must. With a single swing, multiple enemies, you must hit. Basics you understand, I see. A secret technique, time it is to teach. Strong, the last hit of your melee combos, but it leaves you open to counter attack, yes. However, dash before ending a combo you can. Fittingly, dash cancel, it is called. Hmm. Yeah, I've been using that all game, I don't know if you know. Perform five dash cancels by dashing while attacking. Good, very good. To quickly dash away or continue attacking, this technique you can use. In, the, in this, tested now you will be. 
Defeat all twenty. Uh, defeat all the enemies in twenty seconds using dash cancel. Oh, no. Understanding is now begins your final test. Defeat all enemies in 15 seconds using less than 30 attacks and at least three dash cancels in us. That's complicated. Completed the course you have. But far from over your training is. For now your training is over. You must speak to me if you're ready for your next lesson. Mastered my causes you have. Proud I am. Mm. Take this should uh, you should take this you should and return for more training if you can. Level 40 adept gloves. I guess I should have come here earlier, honestly. So, circuit overrides, gold. Yeah, so now we gotta go to Autumn's Fall. Completely miss him. Village remain. Okay, well, this isn't the village remains now, so that's probably why. Not from this map, eh? Man, yeah, not only doing quests, I also want to do some exploration. In general, this is just gonna be a chill stream. Maybe I'll also do this next week. We'll see. A hat kid swears mod. Well then. I don't think I installed a whole lot of mods into Hat in Time. Like the, the big ones that I remember installing are like um one Hello. Hi! What's up? You want to know about the Old War too? It's a pretty dark time in human history. Various colonies waged war against each other. They taught us resources were the trigger, but I heard other stories too. Nah, don't worry. It's all in the past now. Like a thousand years past. But yeah, like, I, I installed like a, uh a mod for like a couple of like weapons which are just cosmetic like replacements for the uh for the umbrella
And I also installed uh, one mod that was um, basically for for the little like uh, sub areas where um, you go through like a Super Mario Sunshine ish. I've already been through here. I don't know why I'm doing this again. A Super Mario Sunshine-ish area to uh, get a timepiece. Um, I installed a mod that, that would make it play the music from Super Mario Sunshine. I think I also installed a couple of like colors for uh, for a kid. Then a couple of levels. I think one of the levels was uh, Bob Bomb Battlefield. Oh, that entrance. You wanted me to go over here. Well, why didn't you tell me that? Hi, the Seeker. You were you were sent to help me with the operation, I suppose. I see. Good, good. Almost got worried. I need a tent if assistance took any longer. Yeah, I really need some sleep. Spend all day serving the area and calibrating our probe here. Yep, this worker wonder was fed the data from the Hellcat leader's device. You can use it to extract energy and data from ancient power spots directly on the track. And this area has quite a few of those, which is ideal for a proper test run to gather data. I should just explain how to operate it so we can finally get this over with and I can go back to bed. Is this guy actually Foos? Simply put, you need to push this device around, move the power the move the power spots that appear in the area. You can move it by attacking. Using heat will greatly increase the distance and velocity. Approaching the power spot will usually attract some hostile wildlife, so that will attempt to protect it. Of course, the power spots will grant them a shield that is almost impenetrable, invincible angry critters. It's okay, Liam. Yes, exactly. But luckily for you, we've got a pro we've got a probe here. When placed on an active power spot, it will sap away the energy and deactivate the shield. So make sure it doesn't get knocked away. Hitting it with cold will stabilize it for a bit, which should help. And that's it. Surely an experienced seeker can figure it out, right? Good. Talk to me again when you're ready and prepared. Hey, yo, seeker. Ready to do this? Alright then, let me start this thing up. Everything's running. First, uh, first spot of power should appear in a second. Ah, there it is. Knock our device to that position, defeat all the enemies in the area, proceed. Just repeat that procedure with every new power spot that pops up, and then we can go on. Uh, and then, it's not getting cold. One thing that they don't really explain is that smacking it with uh, with heat uh, will make it go farther. Get out of my way! to do. Ah, thanks for helping me out there. Now die. I 
Your reward is death. Over here, this stupid Beyblade. Come on. Oh, well, that's not gonna help. Alright, well, thanks for dropping by, Jewel. Uh, if I'm still streaming, then you're absolutely welcome to return to the stream. <laughs> Why wouldn't you? probably going to be the last one since it's right next to the guy. Well, my scanners that you, my scanners show that you've harvested all the power spots. They're all work, I suppose. Shame we're not quite done yet. Just a minute ago, I spotted a high concentration of energy just south of us. Yeah, it seems like the track doesn't want me getting get my overdue sleep. In any case, we may, we need to handle that as well. The data we can extract there could be too value too valuable to ignore. Follow me south so I can get this over with. Great, there you are again. About, about time we finish this task, I would say. This time all the energy signals can be found around that lonely tree there. This perfectly normal tree, with no redeeming qualities whatsoever. Very coincidence that, considering there's nothing really special about the tree itself, now it seems to be rather unstable and fluctuating this time, you should keep an eye on, uh, keep an eye on that. In any case, knocking, at, knocking our probe onto the power spots as before and clearing hostile should do the trick. I'm ready when you are, just give me the signal seeker. Ready to finish the sub seeker? Let's do this. Alright, then let me start this thing up. Probe has booted. Prepare for the first point to appear. Now, okay. Alright, just like before, knock our device on the power spot and defeat all the enemies that might appear. Just remember what I told you about the unstable energy, energy fluctuation. Be prepared to readjust the probe during the operation in case the power spots move around. Now, this might be a little bit more challenging than, uh, than the first one. Or it might not. These guys are level 34, so they're not boosted.
Seems like you're done. Everything's clear. For real this time, finally. I'm gonna skip further fanfare. Our probe needs to get back to HQ and I need sleep. Talk to our leader for our wars, you know the drill. Now excuse excuse me, I gotta get going. Bye. Yeah, let's go turn that in. I think that's gonna about do it for Rookie Harbor. Hi! Woohoo! Welcome back, Seeker! Uh, hi! Oh, sorry, your success made me overly excited. I gotta keep up my dignified leader image or whatever. So, Honored Seeker, your performance in that last operation was exceptional. Hereby, in, in my function as kick-ass leader of our organization, I give you our most official thanks. There was also a great quantity of classified information that was uncovered from, uh, from the data that the probe, uh, the probe exposed. Expect a big expedition into unknown lands in the future. We'll keep in touch, yeah? Bye! Alright, so I will check the quest hub one more time. Make sure that there is nothing other than the um, previously Switch exclusive quest. Oh, there are the two quests that we are currently on, actually. So, New Metal and Sickly Trees. Sickly Trees we've been putting off for a long time. Second year. Alright, um, so Pathway 3, Off-Road 2, and East of Obelisk Lake. Uh... Sorry, give me a second, things are happening. Um, what just happened? Okay, we're fine, we're fine, we're good, we're fine, we're good. I don't know what happened, Explorer Shell just crashed, and then came back up, and now we're fine. We're all fine, everything's fine, here, now. How are you? Good. Okay, the tree is there. Okay, get out of my way, you stupid little cats. So I 
I think I should be able to reach it from around here. See, so I have to take the same path. There we go. This is something that I might have noticed quicker if uh, I wasn't streaming this. Because the act of actually streaming this is making it so that I'm a little bit more in a hurry, so that there's not too much, you know, dead air, basically. So there's two chests there. Got all the chests there. Cicadas. Ah, we've analyzed the Omega Water Blade. Excellent. Okay, that goes to that cave. There's, there isn't anything in that cave, is there? Nope. Ah. And I've just gotten this Twilight Dew super easy from the start. So let's go back to, uh, where was it? Fruits of Autumn. Oh, you're done. Wonderful. Your effort should have quelled the, should have quelled the threat to Autumn's Rise. You know our deepest things. May we continue to preserve the harmony of this world together. Greetings, Seeker. It's good to see you return to us. Hi. As it happens, the well-being of our, of our na the well-being of nature requires our attention once again. Another case of the sickness has been observed in Nam's rise. This, this time in a more intense form. More see as as it has hidden the si uh that. God, freaking hell. It has stricken a sacred tree that has been proven to be vital to the ecosystem of the entire area. 
I fear that healing it will be more arduous than with other cases, but it must be done at all costs. So can I ask for your assistance once again? Wow, that is a lot of stuff that we get out of that. Excellent. I'll give you a cup filled with highly concentrated salve made from the fruits of our gardens. With it, you can treat the disease just like, like before, but there are two vital differences. First, since the condition is more severe, the medication will take time to fully take effect. Also, the strong smell and taste of the salve will lure the, lure the creatures of the area towards it. Thus, after applying the salve, you will need to defend the tree until it's fully, fully healed. I see you understand. Now please be swift. So it's in pathway three. So the closest warp is uh, the old obelisk. Also, how are we doing on chess here? 25 or 29? Not bad, not bad. It's a little Chester. First, let's take care of this sacred tree. That's a lot of dudes. Fortunately, they um, kind of are no match for us because they are level appropriate to the quest this, uh, this level is. It's like tense and threatening music, and this quest is an absolute pushover because we were supposed to do it 20 levels ago. Y'all fall down. Okay, that was perfectly timed. And that should be the last one. Go back to Chief Keeper Bonanza here. I heard that your efforts have once again quelled the threat to Autumn's Rise. Wonderful! You have our deepest thanks. May we continue to preserve the harmony in this world together. Oh, you have another quest. Greetings, Seeker. I'm glad to see you, for our land is in peril once again. The proud bovine has fallen victim to a vile sickness and is now, and is now experiencing burning pain. It annihilated his whole herd in fiery anguish before starting fires all over Autumn's fold. Will you help us bring peace to this tortured being? Mm, I guess. You're a true hero. I know how revolting the thought of putting down a living being must be to you. Yeah, I uh, mean, it's... Uh, not really. Thanks to his burning trail, it became clear that the bovine has hidden itself in a, in a cave under the secluded path. 
You can reach that location by traveling to the northeast of Autumn's Fall. Make haste, young seeker, before the flames of rage can ignite more precious lives. Um, hang on. Where is this? Dense water caverns. Probably a cave. That sure is. Let's see. Dang it. Also, just so just so y'all know, I can barely see right now because um, the sun is pretty much directly in my face, and the Skyrim is so dark. So what do you want from me? Okay. And jump. And jump. Jump and jump. There we go. And that activated that shortcut. More fighting. Yeah, so now we have a shortcut back to the entrance. Good.
Holy crap, that hurt, actually. on top of this. No? There we go. Yeah, that worked. If that was the intended solution or not, but uh, that's what we ended up doing. It's fine. Activate that. And I think it is time for the big fight. Just completely skip phase three. Bye bye. All right, back to uh, Georgia Stanza. You're back, Seeker. So, was the, so the wrath of the proud beast has finally been ex extinguished. That was good to hear. May you rest in peace. May you continue uh, to bring peace and harmony to, harmony to this world. Leah, true words, my friend, and wise. Goodbye. Bye. Leah is indeed a wise guy. Also, I think both um, Emily and Toby ended up leveling up at some point, which is kind of an issue, but whatever. Not too bothered. Okay, so I think... Oh, right, there's still one more quest. Quarters. 
Traitor's Condor. I think is this building. I'm sorry, man, but this this area is restricted to the staff. I see you have business with the board. In that case, please go upstairs and have a nice day. Bye. Hi. Oh, good evening. So you're going we've been expecting you. Mr. Nomsworth spoke very highly of your abilities. Let's hope this stress is not misplaced. As you hopefully know, Rocky Harbor is a central settlement with strong connections all over the city. There's barely a commodity that can that cannot be found in our mighty venture, venues of capitalism. Don't get me started on capitalism. Despite this, we still lack the capacity to, hire, to acquire high quality metal without relying on the other settlements. It'll be your most urgent task to remedy this. I hope we can still count on your assistance. Excellent. Then go to Bergen Village and visit their trade arm of metal We've already uh, no we've already negotiated a satisfying agreement. You'll fulfill our ends of the bargain. Good. Now go and carry out your, your task. Bye. Uh, Bergen Village. Three chests here, geez. Uh, let's see. Traders then, I think. Hi, a day seeker. You've chosen a convenient time to pay me a visit. There's been a problem in the Hermit's House, a popular meeting place on Bergen Trail. Supposedly, their power generator has been malfunctioning in these repairs. With that purpose, they are in need of various materials from different locations. Would your schedule allow for that kind of assistance? Well, that's why we're here. Very good. You can find the Hermit's House at the Spike Heights on Bergen Trail. Talk to the owner of the house for more details. Bye! Excluded mountaintop. I think that's where we fought the uh, the blue guy. Ah, Spike Heights. Okay, Hermit's house is that one. Gotcha. This one. Hey there, fella. Welcome to the Hermit's house. Hi. Hi. Must have been sent by Mrs. Summers to help with our broken generator. Man, we were getting worried. See, without that generator, this room will be pretty chilly soon, I and mean, what's the point of it then? I know, right? So we need some materials to fix that thing, and we're most of them are pretty far away. First off, refined metals. There's traders in Bergen who can refine it for cheaper metal with some others, from cheaper metal with some other stuff. Next, we need metal gears from the temple mine, and some chunks of Bergen ice for the cooling. You should find that ice not far from here. Lastly, we need some fuel. The generator runs on air lumber, which only grows in Ruin Valley. Yeah, that's quite a lot. Those generators sure aren't simple campfires. You got everything? Alright, hope to see you again soon. Before we're all icicles in here. Bye. Okay, back to Bergen Village apparently. Hi! Ah, Low Seeker. Can I interest you in some solid, solid metal? It is especially shiny today. Leah! Ah, you're the assistant from Murky Harbor. Alright then, let me explain the deal. We can deliver some advanced metalworking tools to Murky Harbor, but only if you bring us some uh, certain spare parts. They are expensive to produce these days, but they should still uh, 
There should still be some. There should still be some built into certain machines in the mine. Word on the street that there's only there's uh, one in some room that harbors the power of heat. Whatever that means. In any case, maybe you can find one there so we can uh, bring this deal to a close. Good luck. Bye. Okay. Well, they're making us run around for this one. Temple mine it is then. I probably have to go to the room where we actually got the heat element. Oh, Chamber of Fire. Okay, so, yeah, Chamber of Fire. That seems like an obvious place to look. That would have been where the boss was. Okay, we went one level too low, apparently. Oh, here we go. We have to fight this guy again, apparently. Again from behind, but that wasn't working out. doing that before. There we go. Key item. Smelter parts.
Hi. Hello, Seeker. You got the parts we need? Ah, yes. Those seem perfect. Good job. Well, uh, that'll be more than enough for a nicely advanced metal oven. We'll handle the rest. You can report back to the CTC in Rookie Harbor to get your award. Bye! Yes, I know I have notifications. Please stop notifying me. I am busy. Necessary tools have already arrived and it works splendidly. From now on, we'll be able to trade higher quality metal directly in Rookie Harbor. You've been a great help. Namsworth really deserves a pat on the back for picking you. And you will also get your reward, of course. You should, we should stay in contact for future deals. Bye! I usually try to avoid too much contact with capitalists, but you know, whatever. Now, we should be done with Ruby Arbor. Uh, yeah. Yes, we only have the Switch Quest left. Yeah, that took two hours. All right. Um, so I'm going to take a little break, um, pressing this button. And uh, when we come back, we'll do some more quest cleanup and maybe also find some chests along the way. So, see you in a bit.